Hello my fellow Drive Beyond Horizons players, in this video I'm going to show you a step by step guide on exactly how I myself was able to fix Drive Beyond Horizon crashing on Steam PC. So basically what I did firstly is that I opened up my Steam application right here as you can see and then I just clicked on library. So I clicked on library and then you should be able to see all of your games right here. So now what you're going to do, you're going to actually uh, right click now on Drive Beyond Horizon here, so you're going to right click. Then what you're going to do, you're going to click on manage right here, then browse local files. You're going to click on browse local files and then you should be taken here as you can see. Now what you're going to do in here is to find Drive Beyond Horizon right here. We're going to right click on it as you can see, then you're going to click on properties. And then you're going to click on, just going to see compatibility right here as you can see, click on compatibility. Then you're going to click on run this program as an administrator. Then you're going to click on apply, then click on OK. So this is the first step to be able to fix this issue. The second step, we're going to just open up the uh, game now. So I'm just going to show you. So open up the game and now just click on Control, Shift and then Escape button. And then what you're going to do, you're going to click on details right here, as you can see. Then scroll down and find this one right here. This one that actually takes up CPU, obviously. And then you're going to right click on it, set priority and have it set to high as you can see click on change priority and this is basically exactly how I was able to fix it myself 